Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's your boy LAPD Code Three here, back again with another episode of LSPDFR. As you can see, I'm joined by my partner today, and we're going to be rolling with the LAPD, and we're going to be doing a gang unit episode today. It's been a while since we've done one of these, so we're cruising around in the 2020 Ford Explorer, designed by me, of course, part of my Project LAPD pack, which you can now find available on Discord for the April edition, which now includes the updated uh, interior to where now you have a uh, visible cargo in the back or at least equipment in the back now you actually will have visible equipment in the back uh, We also made some slight adjustments to such as uh, any exterior uh, Things such as the vertexes on the headlights. You can now see the bulbs uh, And some of the vehicles you couldn't some you could but now we got that working also, you can see the lights uh, from all the controls, the radios, the switches, and all that. You can see the lights through the windows now. I uh, had a problem seeing those in the past, but now you can see them. So I hope you guys, if you do download this pack, be sure to leave some comments down below in my Discord and comments under my Discord. Let me know what you guys think of the pack, if you guys like it. And um, I want to say thank you to everyone out there who's uh, been uh, subscribing to me lately. Uh, recent subscriber, Bradley. I uh, want to give a big shout out to him for subscribing to my channel, so thank you for that man, I really appreciate it and I hope you do continue to enjoy my videos. And with that being said guys, we're going to go ahead and get started, so if you guys are new to this video, be sure to hit that subscribe, smash the like on this video, some comments down below. Feedback is always appreciated. And with that being said, Dispatch 9 out of 26, show us 10 8. Copy that. 9, Adam, 26. Proceed to patrol area. All right, let's go. Rancho. All right, we got a uh, rest warrant for Mr. Responder Eddie two. Killer. That is not a unique, that is not a unique name at all. Okay, so an arrest warrant for Eddie Killer. We'll go ahead and uh, pull over somewhere and do a quick checkup on it. Do a quick check up on his rap sheet and see what he has. Uh, we're gonna wait till this light goes green and then we'll find somewhere to park. Hope you guys had a great Easter week and uh, trying to get past through, trying to get through April, man, this month because this has been a really uh, struggling month lately so far. It's been uh, it's been kind of slow, but uh, haven't really had much of a chance to take time to enjoy myself because you know it's just been you know struggling with so much all right hang on a second oh don't do this don't do this hold on all right walk it off there you go walk it off all right let's go have a look at this guy eddie killer real quick before we even think about doing anything all right eddie killer has had an has an arrest warrant for felony murder special circumstances so hence the last name killer Makes sense. Uh, he's got federal. He's got a federal. He had federal charges for altering a military pass or credentials, opening a chop shop, and criminal threats. So this guy's got a rap sheet as big as big as my arm right now. Like, geez, this dude's got a pretty big rap sheet. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and respond. We're gonna send some additional units out that way too, just to be safe. So we'll get a SWAT unit out, and we'll get a local units out as well, just in case. Three, John. Eight units. Respond code two. Backup required near um, the court center in Davis. Copy that. On the way. All right. Uh, recently just got DLS V2. Uh, May the Beast finally gave me permission on Discord to get. Okay, finally gave me the permission, the request, the role to go ahead and grab DLS V2. So I will be switching this year from ELS vehicles to DLS vehicles for all my packs at some time this year. Uh, by later this year, I should have almost all my packs ready for DLS. Uh, it's just a matter of timing, you know, it's all about timing. Gotta make sure that everything goes according to plan, you know, make sure that I have all the vehicles I need, all the lights I need, the equipment, um, make sure I do all my lights right. Recently, I've been having issues with my non-ELS for some reason. It's just uh, my Z mod. I think I forgot how to do my non-ELS vehicles because I've been so hectic with uh, doing with doing regular, you know, with doing regular ELS vehicles. I haven't had a chance to do many non-ELS vehicles, and because of that, I lost my train of thought on it last month and I totally forgot how to do it and I've been messing up here and there all right here we go 
House right here. Is your ambulance traffic Jefferson 11th Ave involving a silver Chevrolet Impala? Right, here we go, make an approach. Some trouble call attached to that vehicle. I'll put that in the killer time. police. Get your hands up, police. Let me see those hands. Police, police, everybody, police. Hands, 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 everybody, show me your hands. Oh, God. Still got the ultimate backup messed up for Elizabeth sheriffs. I gotta get their vest checked out. East 114 Street, apartment 306, the city. Alright, Eddie. I got this one right here. Yeah, so if you guys are wondering when that was an accident because my ultimate backup, I changed the location of all my... I changed the ultimate backup configurations again to fix my SCBs and I guess my uniforms. When I changed the location of the vest, I ended up messing up the location and the ultimate backup as well. So that's why it uh, it's, looks, it's, sh it's showing Coast Guard vest instead of my LASD vest that I have assigned to my custom character. Alright, is this him right here? This is him. Eddie, we've been looking for you, man. The unknown trouble call on Jefferson is so really. What are you doing, brother? The ambulance traffic. Mary Queen 51052, Article 6. So, you're aware you have an active warrant for your arrest, man? You got anything on you? What else? You got anything on you, bro? Drugs, guns, knives, anything like that? Let's go. Roll joint, brown powder, and plastic bag. I'm guessing it's just marijuana that he has in him. All right, let's have these guys checked out. Uh, all his associates—they probably didn't do anything, but they had no—they probably didn't even know that this guy had a warrant for his arrest. So yeah, whatever. he's got nothing of interest. Uh oh, Bob Kelvin though. Hey, or dust my dust my <laughs> I get it dust mites I get it all right all right well this guy we can cut him loose and have him get out of here I'll cut this guy loose he got nothing on him hey there. all right man beat it But you, you, you both, you're both going to jail. So let's go ahead and run. Let's go ahead and run the information on these guys real quick. We're gonna put our rifle back in. We don't need it. All right. So Eddie Killer, we got him for. The murder charges, the warrant he had for him, justice crime, felony level warrant for arrest. Um, not even gonna, not even gonna disregard. I'm gonna disregard what he had on his charges, on what he had in his possession, because I'm pretty sure it was just a roll, of, a roll joint and some brown bag. He might have been just mar mar uh, marijuana, so it could just be marijuana. But dust my, he had a bunch of shit on him. I lost what he had on him, but let me double check see if it's in here. Okay, so he had a compact pistol and a concealed carry holster, a stolen car key fob, and a fully automatic pistol. So he had multiple weapons on him. So let's check his rap sheet. He's got no no warrants, no nothing. Okay, so he's clean on that. And he has no gun permits, so he shouldn't even be having possession of any weapons whatsoever. We're holding up traffic right now. They're going to keep honking at us until we get our stuff, until we get our work done here. Edward, 30 King. Six five union five okay. eight three oh. one five one. Uh, so let's see. Ah! Might have Holy to fix this door to open it a little wider, but I guess it's as wide as it goes. They say these are his weapons, ah! but I'm pretty sure they're fake. Pretty sure these are fake permits. You, are such a dumbass. you bastard! Huh? 
All right, let's get them separated. Assistance required. South of um, the court center in Rancho. We'll get the charges in. We already got. So right now we got him on weapon crimes, possession of two, carrying a loaded firearm, carrying a concealed firearm, and illegal. Well, and that's it, pretty much. All right. Let's get my partner. All right, so Eddie is going to jail, and so is his partner Dust, and that's going to be a code four, guys. We're going to go ahead and get back on patrol. All right, guys, I'm making my way behind this buccaneer because uh, just pulled plates on him, and it turns out it's got an re unknown registered owner as well as uh, unknown information on the vehicle. So we're going to conduct a traffic stop right here on the street. And it looks like he's gonna be taking off on us. Officers report a suspect on the run in Strawberry. Dispatch 9 out of 26, show us in pursuit. We're gonna be on Normandy and Slauson, continuing eastbound. 10-4, copy. He's just running over everybody now. We got a visual on eastbound suspect. We got an air unit flying overhead now. Oh, he just turned, oh, he just collided with the wall there. Let's get some additional uh, LAPD units out here to help us out. Oh, he, that was reckless of him. The court center, Rancho. Copy dispatch. Victor 13 is in the area. I see the perp. We're in pursuit. Bro, does this guy not know how to drive? Yeah, typical day in LA, right? This is how LA drivers drive when they're in pursuits. This is it. Oh, you got him? Right. We've got you! Don't do it! I'm backing you up! Dispatch 9 out of 26. Show Pursuit, pursuit Code 4, 4 Rose, west of South Broadway Street. Attention all units. Code 4, no additional support needed. Code 4, Code 4, We've got shots fired. Code 4, no additional support needed. Eight Union, King Eight What's going on, four. man? So why'd you run from us, huh? Anna, Lilia, Cruz, Clavijo. Why were you, why were three, you running zero, from zero, us? Three, Obama Boulevard, City. You were driving Insurance pretty recklessly, man. So if you're a student driver, why were you driving so damn recklessly? Okay, so right now, you're lying to me several times right now because of the simple fact that... What the hell is all this? That's a siren. Why are you blaring a siren? Your lights are not even on. Okay. Let's see what you got on you. Turn around. And where the hell are they going? He had a gun. He had a gun in his holster. Okay. You got a permit for this gun? Alright, we'll see. What about that car, man? Whose car is that? Whose car is this? I'm asking because it's stolen. I'm asking because it, it comes back as stolen. It doesn't have no plates. It has no. Your plates are not valid. Your insurance, your registration, all that is invalid. So, if this is not, if this is your car, why don't you have the proper paperwork? Why isn't this vehicle registered with the state of California? All right. We have a transport. We have a. We have a transport. Out there, but I want to check this vehicle real quick. Street, subject is female, Asian. 80 years, red hat. 
We got another gun in the back, double barreled shotgun in a carrying case with one in the chamber. 2620 Get this vehicle towed out of here, leave it for investigative services to figure this out. The traffic investigation will figure this right. out at some point. Uh, let's get the flatbed out for it. Flatbed, assistance required near um, the Dollar Pill store in Strawberry. In Strawberry. Backup needed near um, the Dollar Pill store in Strawberry. Strawberry. Oh, yeah. Copy dispatch. Walk I right into the truck. All right, the first two these have these have serial numbers on it. Registered to a Charlie Bone, which I'm guessing is him. So, all right, Charlie Bone. Hi. So right now we have him on vehicular. Let's see, uh, Trying to escape from us. Reckless evading a police officer. We got him on traffic and vehicle crimes. Reckless driving exhibition of speed. Hit and run several times. And then. Possession of firearm. Carrying a loaded firearm. And at the same time, we also got him for a uh, stolen vehicle. Criminal possession of a stolen vehicle. I, can get, I guess criminal possession, receiving stolen property over... And then... And then the documentation, if I can get that, get them for, uh, let me see. Pretty sure it falls under the traffic and vehicle crimes, but. Any unit in the vicinity, 1X26, 1X26, fire department requesting backup. And then driving on the wrong side of the road. Overdose now, fire department requesting backup, 543 Crocker Street, 543 Crocker Street. No breaks for him, so. Alright, let's get him out of here. Alright, Mr. Bone, he's got this officer over here down here, we'll take you out. To uh, the processing, okay? Near, um, we'll be spending a few days in jail until we, get you, until we get, you with, uh, get you in touch with the judge, alright? But right now, your charges are for possession of loaded weapons, Security resisting clear. arrest, felony, reckless evading, and driving on the wrong side of the road, as well as possession of a stolen vehicle with stolen uh, insurance plates and stolen insurance and registration. Alright? All right. Okay, so this call is going to be a code four, guys, and uh, we're going to get back on patrol. Ten four. Here. Attention, all units. We are code four. The vanilla unicorn in strawberry. Respond code three. All right, we got a call of a wanted suspect sighted near the vanilla unicorn. We're going to try to see if we can apprehend him, or her, or them, whoever it is. Try to go this way if we can. Oh yeah, so I got a couple new uh, scripts and plugins that I'm gonna be working with on the next episode, guys. I'm working. I uh, just found out about a couple one, a couple new ones that just got uploaded to LCPDFR. I haven't had a chance to play with them yet and I haven't had a chance to work out DLS yet because I just got it today on discord so it will um, it will be a, it will be a while before I can even get one vehicle working at all even for that but pray for a miracle you know let's hope that I can actually figure it out and it's not as complicated as everyone else claims it to be 
And you know what? I was supposed to get on this side. I'm gonna get behind this guy. Thank you, Roger. And it looks like the suspect is driving on a vehicle, so we'll be able to. So you know what? We might have to get ahead of this light. Let's see if we can identify this vehicle. I think it's that vehicle coming right there. Alright, here we go. This guy's gonna be a baller. Run a plate on it. It's gonna be 82 Ocean Frank Adam 925. Target vehicle license plate. 82 Ocean Frank Adam 925. A traffic violation. A warrant issued. James Sullivan. Approach with caution. That's the guy. Let's see what we got on this guy. He's got an arrest warrant for brandishing a weapon or firearm. Right. I don't know how he's gonna get across this because now we got vehicles. Now we got. Now we got. Let's see if we can get him. We can get him. This is gonna be a long light too, so we're gonna be waiting here a while. Oh, maybe not. Hang on. Maybe we can get. And now we got him for hitting that car. Pull it over, pal. Let's go. And he's gonna take off on us. Officers report a 148 in uh, Chamberlain Hill. Dispatch 9 out of 26. Show us in pursuit. We're gonna be westbound under the. 101 freeway continuing towards Slauson. 10 4, copy that. Requesting an airship overhead. Oh, this guy thinks he's. he's he can drive. Look at that. Just wrecking into everybody as he makes his way. Let's get additional units out. Backup required, west of the Premium Deluxe Showroom in Pillbox Hill. Copy, dispatch. Dispatch, perfect sight. I don't know where this guy thinks he's going to go. Making our way now to Venice and Western. Oh, he's, so now he's illegally going around. It's okay. And he just TC'd into a police officer. Here we go. Travel collision involved with a police officer. So we got him on. So that's just more charges he's adding to the rap sheet right now. We could have just got him for the. Could have just got him over for the uh, for the warrant he had. right now oh and another vehicle he collided with he ain't getting far oh look out look out look out civilian civilian oh watch out Where does he think he's going? I have to get more officers involved here. Assistance required near um, Glass Heroes Auto Repair in Strawberry. Got my way, come on now, people. 
dispatch. We got eyes on the target. Moving to engage. And he's wrecking into every everybody he sees right now. This dude has no care in the world for other people's safety. We're gonna have to shut him down with a spike. Because he hasn't stopped running yet, so we're gonna have to shut him down with a spike. Here we go. Yeehaw. Not much of a jump there, but whatever. Oh, dump, dump, dump. Watch out. Trust me, I could catch up to him if I wanted to. I'm giving him the benefit of the doubt to slow down right now, but it looks like he's not going to be slowing down anytime soon. All right, looks like he's heading to the county line. We're going to shut him down right here. Backup required. Suspect's license plate 82 Ocean Frank A. Uh, oh, oh, oh. Niner We're on our way five. now to the Bray and Franklin right now. Active Franklin. Is in the area. I'll try to get one more spike attempt on him. If he hits the county line, we're taking him. We're going to hit him with a spike. It's most likely he's going. He's gonna go left. Yup, there it is. All right, let's pipe. Let's spike him right here. Assistance required. Suspect's license plate eight two Ocean Frank Adam Niner two five. Boom. He's done. Hey, he spun out. He's done. Oh shit. Right into the Holly Hills. Car, see if anybody else is in there. Nope. Temple okay, looks clear. Ringer, two five, two five West Vernon Avenue at Brian Temple AME Church. Incident two six eight seven. Half ounce of white powder in a plastic bag. You know how many cop cars you ran out, you hit, man, on the way to this little stunt you pulled. Do you even know why we were chasing you, bro? We were chasing you because you had a warrant. That's all. We were gonna pull you over because you had a warning. You had a warrant, man. Why'd you run from us? Were you aware of that? You was? So why'd you run? What do you got on you, man? You got anything on in your pockets? Turn around. We got more officers arriving on scene now. Late as hell. Toy gun with the orange tip removed, handful of various coins and packing tape. I ain't even gonna, I'm gonna disregard that. But I do want to find out what was these drugs that he hid in his car. Let's double check this real quick. Let's see what he had here. Let's, uh, let's check this out. Most likely it's gonna be fentanyl though. From what it's looking like. Or not? Hmm. Or no wet visible. Oh, PCP. There it is. 63, standby. Alright, let's go ahead and get his charges in and then uh, we'll go ahead and get a tow truck and transport for him back to booking. So right now we'll get him for his misdemeanor crime, which now has a level has gone up from that to a felony level warrant now. Then again, you know what? It is a misdemeanor warrant, so I should get him for that. Uh, right now we'll also get him for reckless evading police officer. Figueroa and King. Reckless, reckless driving, driving on the wrong side of the road, exhibition of speed. Right. Hit and run. And then criminal possession of controlled substance, which you found was PCP.
Not even gonna go for the toy gun yet. 2334 to the Vincent Land, 1005 South Central Avenue, Clip 3, Incident 2698, RD 1824. Dispatch 9 Adam 26, can I get a tow truck to my location for a black SUV on the Holly Hills? Damn it! Flatbed, assistance required, east of uh, the CNT building, Vinewood Hills. Alright. Not even gonna sh not even sure. Okay, he's gonna be here. So we need to get this guy out of here. He's just gonna be blocking up traffic too. With the delay with my victim. Alright, let's get him out of here. A34 rod. Assistance required. East of um the CNT building, Vinewood Hills. It's a great pursuit, guys. Great pursuit. Good job, everybody. <laughs> Name again, it was James Sullivan. Okay, so Mr. Sullivan will not be going to jail, and we're gonna code for this scene, guys, and uh, get back on patrol. All right, guys, so we just made ourselves out of service. We're gonna go ahead and head back to the station after two hours. We did have one traffic stop earlier, uh, didn't get it on film because it wasn't really worth it. The guy was just uh. He was just trying to get home. He's, he pulled off. He was pulling a third. He was pulling a double shift, and he was just trying to get home. And he ran a red light. It was nothing serious, though. We didn't even give him a ticket for it. He was just rushing to get home. He just had a long day. I can understand that. We've all had those double shifts where we just uh, we make one little mistake. You know, we're just so tired of everything. All right, so let me go ahead and dismiss my partner so we can go back. He can go ahead and go in the station, get our paperwork ready, so we can go ahead and start doing it. I'll see you in there, partner. <laughs> And uh, I'm gonna go ahead and start doing the court cases. So we're gonna start off with Eddie Killer, who had a felony level warrant for arrest. He's gonna be doing one year in prison with his uh, associate Dustmai. He's gonna be uh, doing only 10 months in prison with fine $1,400. Uh, Charlie Bone is got multiple convictions so he's got he's going to be doing five years and one month in prison uh license will be suspended for well over several years as well according to this and yeah license has, or actually i lied said license has been revoked after the rec after the reckless evading a police officer so and James Sullivan, who's got the reckless evading plus the multiple misdemeanor charges, one year, four months in prison. So I'd say the MVP goes to Mr. Charlie Bone. Way to go, Charlie. You have become the most valued perp of the episode. And that beats out everybody else. Wow. That's just a surprise. So that is going to do it, guys, for our episode today. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys did enjoy that, and I've got plenty of more episodes to go through, guys. And I hope you guys will take the time to subscribe to my channel, hit that like button, don't forget to enable notifications, and leave some comments down below to me what you guys thought of the episode. And if there's anything that you guys would like me to do down the road, be sure to check out the community section on my channel, guys. Well, I will be doing active votes every week so you guys can check out what my next episode will be. And you guys have to remember, it's your vote that counts that helps me make my episodes. So thank you guys so much. Stay safe this weekend, and I will catch you on the next one. Take care.